The Trade Union Coordination Centre convening a joint media briefing said strict action will be taken if the government will not take steps to lock down the country for at least 10 days. Who is not urging the government to go for a scientific-based lockdown at the moment? When journalists question, the cabinet also say that a lockdown must be imposed. Medical specialists and religious leaders say that the country must be shut down. The PHIs who are interacting with COVID-19 patients 24-7 say that the country must be placed under a lockdown. The government, which is oblivious to this requirement, is operating in a narcissistic manner by sacrificing the lives of the general public. We would like to tell this government, who printed 600 billion rupees, that the people of this country will not start dying if you print another 50 billion rupees. We all know that this government cannot do this. If this government does not start printing at least another 100 billion rupees and provide the people with the facilities to stay at their homes, we will see dead bodies piling up on the streets. 12 COVID-19 cases were reported from Parliament where operations are carried out adhering to safety protocols. So lockdown is imposed at places where VIPs or elites are gathered but the country is open for the normal working class people. Why is that? The rulers of this country do not care for the deaths of normal people. This government that comprised people who claim to have moulded the economy of the country say that they will not be able to feed the mouths of 4.5 million if the country is closed. Who is to give us answers to this issue? We would like to request the government to place the country under a lockdown based on a scientific method for at least 10 days starting from this Friday. State officials will abstain from performing their duties if the government will not take steps to place the country under a lockdown. Meanwhile, the All Ceylon Government Medical Officers Association highlighted the need for an island-wide lockdown. This time, the general public is also requesting a lockdown to be imposed, even they agree that the spread of the virus cannot be prevented without going for a lockdown. What is the government doing? They just impose inter-provincial travel restrictions to show that they've done something to curb the spread of the virus. When the virus is detected in every province and the Delta variant is present in every province, it is clear that simply imposing travel restrictions between these provinces is unscientific. Travel restrictions similar to those imposed during the first wave are what is needed at the moment.